Do my RFID tags work the same way everywhere in the world? Well, you better stick around if you want to find out. Today, we're going to talk about frequency, what it is and why it's important. Frequency is the pitch at which RF waves operate at. And it's important to understand this and regulate this. Otherwise, there would be a lot of interference and poor performing RF devices out in the world. In RFID, frequency bands are typically measured in megahertz. The two most common being HF or high frequency and UHF, ultra high frequency. We'll keep things simple today and focus only on UHF, which in RFID has a global range of 860 megahertz to 960 megahertz. Different countries use different frequency windows to read their RFID tags. Now this can get really complicated and confusing, but what you need to remember is that there's two main frequency bands, the FCC band, and the Etsy band. The FCC band is used in the United States and it has a smaller range of 902 to 928 megahertz. Whereas the Etsy band, which is typically used in European countries, is a smaller window of 865.6 to 867.6 megahertz. So does this mean only certain tags work in certain countries? Yes, and no. Most passive UHF tags are designed to work in the global frequency range, which is 860 to 960 megahertz. But what that does mean is the performance in the read range might vary country to country based on which tag you're using. There's a lot to understand when it comes to RFID, but that's why I'm here making RFID simple. So make sure you leave some comments below on what other RFID concepts you want made some